Hi guys, hi, hello. <sighs> I can't believe I'm finally recording this intro, like it just doesn't feel real, but welcome to a new set of vlogs. And oh, just I can't believe it. <laughs> yeah, I can't actually believe the day has come, but <laughs> welcome to a new set of Walt Disney World vlogs. It's gonna be emotional, it's gonna be emotional. Just bear with us. <laughs> But uh, yes, we are heading to Walt Disney World today. It doesn't even feel real to say those words. If you're like me and you've had a trip booked back in 2020 or, you know, last year or something and you've just been waiting and waiting and hoping you can get there. And it just, when the day comes, it just doesn't feel real at all. But yeah, welcome to my channel anyway, guys. My name is Laura, uh, just quickly saying hello and I love making Disney trip vlogs. I'm pretty new to vlogging, well, newish. I try and do the trips I do um, to Disney, vlog them as much as I can, And but I'm definitely not new to Walt Disney World. It's gonna make me sound really old, but I've been going quite a lot over the last 30 years. <laughs> so yeah, I am excited to get back, but I feel like this trip's gonna be really different and I feel like it's the first time going again. There's quite a lot of us going as well, so I'm going with all my family. If you've watched my vlogs before as well, you will have seen my Disney bestie, Stacey. She's coming along with me as well. And it's my nephew's first trip, so he's nearly three. Originally going in 2020, he was only gonna be nine months old. Now he's nearly three. <laughs> he can probably go on quite a lot of the rides and uh, the roller coasters and things, it's, it's mad, but yeah, we're all going together, my sister, my brother-in-law, and then we have some friends already over there. One of my best friends got married a couple of days ago and they're going on their honeymoon, so they're gonna be there too. And yeah, it's just gonna be amazing to have everyone back in the magic and just being with my family as well. I last went in 2019 with Stacey, Sarah, like a girl's trip. And it was kind of like a last minute trip and I'm so glad we did it because then we haven't been since. And yeah. Ooh. I can't believe it. I've got my lounge fly packed there, my purple wool lounge fly. Bought this probably during lockdown and yeah, can't believe I'm using it. Yeah, make sure you're subscribed because new vlogs will be coming out every week, hopefully, and there's going to be a lot of them. I'm going to cover everything I can, a lot of new things for us, and that's the thing about Walt Disney World, there's always something new. A lot has changed, obviously, since the pandemic and all of that. And so, and a lot of new things just have been made, new rides, new shops, new restaurants, just everything. It's just, there's lots to do. And I'm gonna try and capture all the new bits and every day something new is coming and happening in Disney. So yeah, I will show you all of that. We're flying with Tui today. Uh, first time doing that to Florida. And we are doing premium, a little treat for us all. And I'll go into detail of all of that as we go on. So yeah, flying from Manchester, heading there soon. It's currently 5.30 in the morning. <laughs> The sun's just coming up, it's lovely. And we are staying at Disney. So we're staying at the Disney's Coronado Springs, which we last stayed at 20 years ago. So lots has changed since then. So yeah, we're flying into Melbourne Airport. So a brand new airport for us. Brand new airport, it's kind of only just been built. Well, not only just been built, but it's only kind of opening up. And two, we've only just started flying this year in 2022 and it's a very small airport very different to Orlando International so I will and I know a lot of people are going there or using that from the UK now because it's a two-way direct flight from the UK so I want to show kind of how the airport works is it easier than um Orlando International and all that stuff but yeah I will show you the rooms everything all of that stuff and I just can't wait can't wait to share these vlogs so I'm gonna grab my stuff and wave a suitcase <sighs> all ready to go. Stacey should be here soon. We're getting picked up and yeah, can't wait to share these vlogs. Can't wait to do this. Just basically so happy to be able to go with my family and share these vlogs with you and all of that stuff. So yay! I can't, I can't believe it. I just can't believe it. I feel really sick. <laughs> it just doesn't feel real. Okay, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna get all my stuff together and We'll see you in the airport or on the way to the airport. Keep watching and yeah, let's go to Disney World.
very busy. We'll uh, fill you in on the whole drama of getting through the airport. <laughs> but I've just got some pastries, some breakfast, but yeah, it's really nice. Here's coffee in there, in the bar. Waiting for everyone else because they've got stopped at security, so just needed a coffee, needed some food. Just moved over to this side. Caleb's got his cornflakes. Caleb, you have your breakfast? <laughs> Coffee machine over there. Those seats are comfy, don't they? Those <laughs> big, so big sofas. Got some more food as well. We're gonna go get a drink in a minute from the bar? Yes. Yeah? <laughs> get a little drink. Everyone's here now. Had a bit of trouble coming through security and it's just it's so busy, but we'll let you know about that. Yes, please, yeah. Um, so you get an alcoholic drink per person. Just notice these little straws. The bees on. They're so cute. <laughs> Just finishing off in the lounge. We've got a little uh, box food. Has anyone enjoyed the lounge? Yes. <laughs> Not sure Caleb has. <laughs> oh yeah, he's falling about. We're in the escape lounge, and yeah. Um, yeah, so there's all like there a buffet, like hot buffet food, um, pastries, juice, and then you can have a drinks at the bar. So these are complimentary as well. Can you have as many like alcoholic drinks as you want, but you just have to go at one at a time and get there them. You Hello. Yes. <laughs> you enjoyed your breakfast. So yeah, we've got about an hour left till we have to board. Uh, so we're gonna go in the duty free, grab some stuff, might get a new perfume. Emma's gonna look at some Emma's my sister. She's gonna look at some um, sunglasses and yeah, we're gonna go and do that. Yeah, it's been very nice. Show what's in the bag, Stacey. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god, what's it? <laughs> so you do get this little bag. You get headphones as well. Like these nice comfy ones. Caleb's in front of me here. Yeah. Your tables on the side as well. I didn't even record any of that as well. <laughs> Sorry. So, sexy sound. Oh, nice. <laughs> Lovely, then. Um, a paper bag? No. <laughs> Toothbrush and toothpaste. Wow, I need a toothbrush. I've not uh, packed a toothbrush. <laughs> it's like eyelash glue. <laughs> Fair, I, do, I need a toothbrush. I mean, that's decent. Yeah, nice, nice. <laughs> oh, yeah. 
wait and book for food. <laughs> yeah, like that. And oh, a lip balm, a Rituals <gasps> lip balm. Wow. Oh, it's not going to focus. There we go. Should we do the beauty thing? Yeah, yeah. Be a beauty vlogger now. <laughs> Perfect. Yes. And a uh, face moisturizer. Oh, perfect. That's so good. Very nice. I'm guessing this is Excuse what you my get tan you. line here. <laughs> Choose what you get your premium. It's, actually, it's decent, isn't it? Yeah. Nice. We've also got a little. Um, mine's not the jaws lift. Mine's a little. Oh, there we go. Um, little USB charger there. And then and like a battery charger there as well. Where are your um? Where's your TV? Rick James. Hello. Rick James. I don't know. Where's your TV, Caleb? Um, where's, your, where's your screen? Where's your screen? Is it down there? On the side. I think it's in the arm, isn't it? Figured it out. Ah. Wow. You've got one. Oh my goodness! Look at that. Your own little TV. Ah, uh, that's good, isn't it? Um, what are you going to watch? See my TV stuff. I've just got a little drink. So it's got a little, um, little bit of fizz. Yes. It's weird not being on a window seat, but it's very comfy. Loads of space down here as well. A little footrest. Nice. Oh, we got to the movies. The Dark Knight. <laughs> Watch that. Stacey's on the gin. <laughs> That's gin in there. <laughs> extra, lo extra large measurements. <laughs> okay, food has arrived. Yeah. Stacey's gone for the beef yeah. and veg. I believe it's beef and ale. Beef and ale. I've got the wild mushroom pasta. Just look like looks like that. And you get like a little bit of bread and hummus there. You get a bread roll. And a lemon tart pudding, and then cheese and crackers as well. So it's really nice, smells good as well. And I'll say tea and coffee later. Plug <laughs> <laughs> it in. afternoon tea. So we've got a scone, clotted cream, jam and sandwich. What's the sandwich? I think it's really good one. Well and we have a very, very special announcement to make. We have a beautiful couple on board sitting at row 15, so 15 B and C. So John and Louise and their lovely son James. They got married last Sunday on the 15th. Beautiful Cheshire wedding that I've even seen the photographs. So congratulations from all of your crew, the Platts who are sitting in first class at the front, all your other <laughs> friends and family. Can we please have a round of applause please for John and Louise Woo! and also James. <laughs> just a little tip for John, just remember those five magic words, yes dear, anything you say. <laughs> this is the moment, I feel the heat. <sighs> Heading towards the coach now, We've done immigration, luggage. Yeah. Okay, it's all go. Oh, it's warm. Oh, look, go and get a little bag off the lady. Look at that. So sweet. So our bus, a nice pink bus. Exciting. Stacey, it's pink and exciting. <laughs> Louise and John have gone on there as well
Right, we're gonna open our room. I've got a mini one. Right, the other way, Stacey's gonna do it. Right, we'll do a room tour in a minute. We've just got to get settled, get our bags in, take it all in. Oh my God. So we've checked into our room. We're heading over at the bridges and we're going to go to the, like the marketplace, like food court thing, quick service bit and get our resort mugs. Everyone's following us. So we're over here in Casitas, is it called? Casitas 5. Where are Casitas right? 5. I think it, because oh, we, we remember we watched, that's what we were doing. Sure that's <laughs> that's yeah. Oh my god. So that's the Three Bridges Bar. It feels like we were here yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> like sat there, we were having yeah. a drink and what like, oh my god, fireworks. Right, we're back in the room. We are rough. We've been up 24 hours. But we're going to show you the room quickly and then we're going to bed because it's been a long day. But yeah, <sighs> all happy. We'll show we've done, we've already like done some damage in the shops as well. But anyway, <laughs> let's show you the room. We're staying at Coronado Springs and we're in the Casitas um, building five. But yeah, we'll show you the room now. Okay, I am by the door. There's lots of stuff in here already. Um, <laughs> um, yeah, this is a moderate resort. Uh, Stacey stayed here last time she was here in 2019. I've stayed here like 20 years ago. All the rooms have been redone since obviously I stayed here, but it's just amazing. It's massive. It's bigger than like what it seems in vlogs and things and it's amazing. So you've got a little seating area here. You've got coffee and I can't wait to try the 50th. Joffrey's blend. Can't wait to try that. Did they have this last time? Not not this 50th, but the no, yeah, yeah. Had the, machine. The, the, the machine was yeah. here when I came, yeah, so in the You've got the ice bucket and cups, a, a light here, fridge. Because we've already bought. Well we're gonna eat them now, I'm not gonna put them in the fridge, obviously. Mine's probably melted. We've just bought the essentials from the shop. Got to. Uh, massive, massive TV. We've got our names on there. Lots of uh, storage there. I do want to unpack all my suitcase, but whether can be bothered right now. <laughs> no, I'm thinking about it, but you just do it. Yeah. Mirror here as well. Bin there. And then two massive beds. I love like these pictures as well. And you've got the uh, USB ports here as well for you, like charging your phone and whatnot. Safe. Ooh. Big safe as well, isn't it? Yeah. It's very good. And then, oh, this is so cool. Stacey, demonstrate the... <laughs> Please excuse my experience. We've literally, 24 hours we've been up. Well, oh, we can do like outfit of the day, like fashion show. Hi, Matthew, I'm going to be a Disney princess. Yes. <laughs> Love it. Massive, massive like bathroom area, two sinks, all of your good old H2O products as well. Oh, zoom out. Oh. Yeah, then the bathroom, shower, toilet, and you've got the H2O uh, shampoo, conditioner, and body wash there as well, which we love. <gasps> sturdy wardrobes, <laughs> very, very tall, sturdy wardrobe right there. Oh, and then like all this space here. Like massive, massive mirror. Well, cool. Um, I guess in here you've got extra pillow, blanket, iron, ooh, um, hair dryer, and your hangers. So we need to sort all our stuff out there. But yeah, any questions, guys, about the resort? Comment um, on this video. Ask any away, and I will try and answer best I can. We we're just saying, there's like the beds are really high up. <laughs> But you can put your suitcase under there. We think anyway. I'm gonna give it a go. It's not. It's not. That's not good for it. Five point three. Five point three. <laughs> What's this? Five three. Select. No. Just. Just go back. <laughs> right. We're trying to get. Ah. Ah. Oh. <laughs> 
Oh, I love it so much. I don't know. <laughs> it's a shame. It should be the first thing, shouldn't it? Um, well, Disney World today. I can find it. When oh, I'm got Disney Club. What Disney World? What was that? Let's try. Oh. Oh no. <laughs> Stacy's having a crisis. <laughs> Never listen to a Stacy packing video. <laughs> all right guys we are so tired and we are just unpacking well i've unpacked stacy's doing her stuff now and yeah it's been such a long day <laughs> but free of makeup ready for bed probably gonna wake up at like 4am that's what usually happens but it's just the best when you're just too excited and you've got to get up and but yeah, we thought I'd just go through quickly like the airport experience today and stuff because I didn't really speak about it too much earlier on. We did premium uh, with Tui and this is mainly because when we booked our holiday back in 2020 to kind of keep us with them and like to still have the booking with Tui, they gave us a 20% incentive and we decided to go for premium, which we'd never done before. And gotta say the flight was amazing the actual flight we were delayed two hours due to kind of a technical thing with the tvs i think was it or the... i don't know we weren't just delayed as in like we were delayed in the airport we were delayed, delayed on, on the, plane. the plane we yeah. were already on the plane and we, so we sat on the plane for an extra two hours yeah it kind of when we once got going it didn't feel like it but yeah, at the time it was like what's going on and it felt like we were never going to go and, and it wasn't too his fault it was you know so they were just being safe weren't they but yeah and then we had to wait for like the ground staff to get us off and all of that yeah. stuff and then um, yeah so it was like about 10 hours on the plane altogether but the pre like the seats were amazing the food was really good like i don't usually like plain food um but it was really really good and the surface service not that word again the like the air hostess and the ladies who looked after us oh my god they were amazing yeah i think she was the manager she was mainly with us but she made some, so my friend um one of my best friends louise uh her new husband only got married a couple of days ago and their son there they were on the same flight they were back in economy and she made such a fuss of them um gave them a bottle of prosecco gave them some sweets and then did an announcement so um i popped it in in the vlog earlier on so she made like this announcement on the uh, tannoy to the plane and, 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 and like a round of applause and everything it was so good she was amazing and um yeah just really looked after us there was drinks constantly and cut this like loads of leg room caleb did so well like for for a two-year-old on like an you know he slept for two the two hours we were delayed he slept he had a nap and then but the rest of the time had a little wander around and wanted to kind of move around with us but was just really really good and um he did so well and he was still running around and being crazy even before when we got here so don't know where he gets energy from but we um yeah we really enjoyed premium didn't we like we all said like we can't like we've been spoiled now and we don't want to go back to the economy but the only thing was you do get extra benefits of premium like fast track and things they didn't really work out to our favor today with Manchester Airport being a bit crazy. So as soon as we checked in, the guy checking us in asked for our esters, like evidence of our esters, which we've never been asked for before. Now, I've not traveled to America in three years, is it now? And now Stacey had printed hers out. I know a lot of people do print them out, but I, I didn't know kind of what to do. I thought you, it was all linked to your passport, but he wanted to see it. And then we, so I had to go on the site, get on my ester, so did the rest of my family so there was like another five of them and my sisters wouldn't load up so it was an all a bit bit stressful and bearing in mind that the actual website doesn't say yeah. it just says um there's no need to print out your esther because it's yeah. connected to your passport number yeah so this whole check-in of esters is all new i've only ever printed my i don't know why i do it but i've always yeah. done it so it was just by luck or chance that i had it but it's a strange one because it's never been done before so but i think it's worth just pointing out that 
if you go in if you can print it print, print it, it or, or, just or screenshot it or, or it. download it yeah. I, I ended up downloading mine but basically so then we so we were quite delayed then we, we didn't there was a massive queue to check in we were only behind one family but because that all took so long with the esters we were delayed but my friends um so louise and john they weren't even asked for their esters so it's like a kind of who you get at, on the desk which is annoying because you think like we were so stressed if you know what if my sisters hadn't have worked and it was not a good start anyway to get checked in and a bit of a worrying start that didn't seem like we needed to show that and, and the guy even said oh you'll have to show it in america when we when we land which we didn't at all like when we went through um, immigration in america a breeze like really easy so he took my um took a picture of my eyes some people had their fingerprints nothing at all so it, it's kind of different rules for different people which is really really stressful when you think you've got everything organized but i would just say maybe print out your esters just from my experience today anyway and then we end up in the fast track for the security which did like bypass a lot of people but we get, ended up getting split up um, my sister went down another lane with the pram they got sent down another lane which then was really backed up and delayed so we ended up all waiting and we, me and Stacey went ahead to the lounge, which was lovely, busy, but um, it was, and we also, yeah, we didn't get given those. So everyone got give, given like a um, like a voucher gold. for the lounge, like a gold ticket. We weren't given them by our checking guy, obviously. And um, it was fine because we had, our booking was all like linked. Yeah, lovely food in there and drinks. You can have like a, your drinks, we had a few, we had a Bailey's, we had like a few books fears. And um, that was a lovely, like, way to start the holiday anyway. And what else went wrong? <laughs> so, flight amazing. Would recommend premium with Tui. Staff amazing. We then get to Melbourne Airport, which was literally, oh, like, yeah. you could smell the fresh paint. It was so brand new and proper, like, it just put together really quickly. It's just yeah. not a... It's not complete the airport. Just bear in mind, it's really, really, really small. I think only, like, one flight comes in at a time really quick to get to the baggage area but basically it was a premium can go off first they kind of get there's only there's only about 50 of us in premium you all end up in this like holding area for your baggage first before you go through immigration and it, so having the fast track to get off for premium thinking you could kind of beat the queue and get through immigration doesn't really matter because you're all you all end up in there then you're all waiting then for a good 20 minutes for the bags to get loaded off so it was a bit pointless really having that fast track you literally then already got about 10 steps and you're in immigration um, and that went really quick as well. So from getting off the plane to being on the bus, it was only about an hour. So if you think about um, Man Manchester International, Orlando International, sometimes you can be in immigration for two hours or an hour at least just in immigration. So the, the, the airport is tiny. We are then uh, walked out, you get greeted with a little goodie bag as I put in the vlog, which had like crisps and an Oreo cookie and a, and a water. And then the bus was about an hour 20, something like that, I think. Yeah. Then, yeah, you're obviously coming from um, further away from like uh, Orlando International. So it did feel like a little bit of a longer journey. But as soon as you start going picking up like the Disney areas and like the signs yeah. and stuff, you know, you're getting close. So it was really good to get there. And we saw, we ended up stopping at Pop Century first and saw a bit of the Skyliner and then checked into Coronado. And that was really easy to do as well. So yeah, checked in okay. We have the um, deal from, I think it was last year. So we've got a, a food voucher. That was just sent to an email from someone in the in the party. So we, we were all three separate bookings. So I've got that. We've used that already for uh, for some food before. As you saw, we had, um, well, actually I'll insert a clip here. And we had a burger and the chicken tenders. We also picked up, up, up our resort more. And yeah, we could buy the resort mugs with that food voucher as well. So we've got about $850 between us. And so it's all on like a barcode on an email. I think you can use that for um, mobile ordering as well, but we'll go through that if we do use it for that. But we picked up our uh, resort mugs and paid with that. And we've got a gift card for $200 as well. I think we have to activate that somewhere. We'll show you that too when we do that. But yeah, all really good. The result's gorgeous room's gorgeous and i can't wait for uh, the next two weeks <laughs> so yeah all happy we just we just keep saying we don't believe we're here 
it doesn't feel real yet we feel like we're just watching like someone else's vlog or something it's crazy we've already bought stuff in the gift shop i've already bought the 50 of coffee stacy's bought two pairs of ears along with her 17 pairs she's brought with her <laughs> so definitely make sure you're following us both on instagram i'll put our instagram um names on the screen here so you can see like outfits we do stacy has some cool outfits with her ears and we're gonna take lots of pictures and yeah make sure you follow us there but yeah all happy stacy obviously i full-on cried when i walked into this room <laughs> absolutely just oh, cried it's so, so good so yeah i'm gonna head to bed now look absolutely rough see how much, <laughs> much sleep we get and we are heading to animal kingdom tomorrow uh, Boma for breakfast first and then Animal Kingdom's our first park. Get to see my nephew, see it all for the first time. He's already just kind of so excited and it's, it's dead, dead cute. But yeah, make sure you're subscribed and follow us on Instagram, all of that good stuff. And we will be back with a new vlog in Animal Kingdom and Disney Springs and everything else. But yeah, thank you for watching our travel day and I'll see you guys soon. Bye. Bye.